Okay, so we need to draw a distance time graph here. Let's have a look. All the leaves home at 7am. She walks at a speed of 4 miles per hour for 90 minutes. She stops for half an hour. She then walks home and arrives at 11am. Draw a distance time graph to show all this journey. So we might have to do some working out for this on the side. So she leaves at 7am. Uh, let's have a look at just this particular bit to start with. So she walks at speed of 4 miles per hour. And her time is 90 minutes. And I'm going to change that straight away to 1.5 hours. So when I do my do stop talking triangle, I want to find out the distance. So I cover up distance and I need to do speed times time. So 4 times 1.5, 4 times 1 is 4, 4 times a half is 2, so that's going to be 6 and we're working in miles. So one, after one and a half hours, so that's from 7, add an hour and add a half, so that's here, at that point she's 6 miles away. So let's go and put that on, I'm going to put a little dot there and then I'm going to try and draw a line. See if this works. There we go. Okay. So that's the first bit. So the next bit is that she stops for half an hour. So from 8.30, so from here, from here till 9, that's stopping for half an hour. Again, I can draw that line on. And then the last bit, Orla then walks home and arrives at 11 a.m. So I'm going to get my... So we're going to draw my line from where I finished all the way to 11 a.m. There we go. And that's my graph. This one here, I've got to draw the graph, so it's probably best if I do my work in first before I muck the graph up. So, Teddy leaves home at 1. Let's just get my highlighter out to start with. So he leaves home at 1. He drives an average speed of 60 kilometres per hour for two and a half hours. He stops for 30 minutes. He then drives home at an average speed of 50 kilometres per hour. Okay, so the one thing that I can definitely put on to my graph is he leaves at 1300 hours. He drives at an average speed, let's look at that bit now. So speed is 60 kilometres per hour. Time is two and a half hours. I'm going to change that to 2.5 straight away. I want to know the distance. Do stop talking. If I cover up the distance, I need to be doing speed times time. So 60 times 2.5. 60 times 2 is 120. 60 times a half is 30. 120 add 30 is 150 and that's distance so it's uh, kilometres for this question so 150 kilometres he stops for 30 minutes and he drives home so I know the maximum distance we're going to go is 150 kilometres so let's have a look how I can spread this out on the y-axis now because the y-axis is going to represent the distance I'm just going to put D for distance so we've got, I need to get to 150 at the moment, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, there's only 9 spaces there. Um, so if I go up in 20s, that'll get me to 180. So let's do that. So I've got 20, 40, 60, 80, 
100, 120, 140, 160, 180. Okay, I'm not going to do anything on the time at the moment because I need to figure out um, the total time. So at the moment, we've got two and a half hours and 30 minutes. So at the moment, we're up to three hours. Now we need to take into the last part. So we've got, he then drives at home an average speed of 50 kilometres per hour. So speed... is 50 kilometers per hour. We don't know the time, but I know the distance now because I know he's got to go home and he's just traveled 150 kilometers. So do stop talking. I want to know the time. So it's distance divided by speed. Distance is 150, divided by speed is 50, 150 divided by 50 is 3, it's time, so we're working in hours, 3 hours. So that's going to be 3 hours, earlier it was 3 hours, so we need a total of 6 hours along the bottom. Let's have a look, 1... One, two, three, four, five, six. That's perfect. So we've got fourteen hundred, fifteen hundred, sixteen hundred, seventeen hundred, eighteen hundred, nineteen hundred. Okay. So let's start drawing our lines. Okay, so he leaves home at leaves home at 1 uh, and he drives 150 kilometres in two and a half hours. So two and a half hours, so one, two, three, that's going to be here for two and a half hours. And we just said he drives 150 kilometres, which is about here. So let's match that up, that's about there, get my line, there we go, about there. Okay, he stops for 30 minutes, so I'm going to do that in green, so he stops between 3.30 and 4, because that's these bits here, so we're currently here, and he stops half an hour, I can draw that one on. And then he drives home at an average speed of 50 kilometres per hour. And we've worked that out that that takes three hours. So from four, it's going to take till seven o'clock. And we're done.